now i'll show you how to create the assignment in moodle cloud platform as well as uh, you as a faculty how one can uh, evaluate the ass uh, assignment so that's a demonstration i'm going to do now so to do that uh, this is the sample course which i have created just go to the site home and then click your uh, course that is already created um, here so this is what my course page so here itself uh, on the top of the page itself i want to create the assessment so you just uh, turn editing on and then uh, add an activity or resource here the first option is assignment choose that and then click add so i'm just uh, naming this assignment as one so here you can uh, ask the assignment question suppose if you want to share any of the files to your students related to the assignment you can post all those files here uh, i'm just asking you a question explain the role of theory in testing the hypothesis so this is a question i'm asking so i need the answers in the form of a text here you can set the time duration of this assi uh, assignment so uh, this assignment is available from today and then the due date is 22 uh, you can change the date if you want to fix some cutoff date you can also fix submission types whether you want to allow text to based uh, uh, assignments or uh, submissions or you want to um, keep file formats if you check this file submissions you can also choose the file format i mean the acceptable file formats for example in terms of document files whether you need the assignment in pdf document format or rich text format or word format or word document so anything you can choose so as far as this assignment is concerned i don't need uh, the documents basically i need the online text so even you can set the word limit also so i'm setting word limit as 300 words so within 300 words only they have to write their answers here you can uh, select the feedback type submission settings request student to click the submit button and then uh, you can keep it as yes and then require the student accept the submission statement that's okay attempts reopened and then maximum attempts how many times you can give group submission settings and then uh, notifications grade how many marks you want to assign so i'm assigning 10 marks for this question or uh, assignment grade to pass you can fix five as a grade to pass if you do, uh, if you consider this as a ungraded assignment even you can fix zero as a maximum grade anything is possible and then uh, common module settings so there's all the couple of options you can explore and then click save and return to course now the assignment is created now i'll show you how it will look like from the student window so i'm just visiting the student page so this is one of the student enrolled into this course so go to site home click the respective course so here the student will be able to see the assignment so as a student i'm clicking this and here you will be able to see the assignment question explain the role of theory in testing the hypothesis submission status no attempt not graded friday and then six days seven hours has left so now i'm going to submit the assignment here so you can type some uh, uh, text here theory will explain the theory is used to justify the cause and effect relationship among the variables so theory is highly used wherever the researchers are testing the hypothesis something like that you can write so up to 300 words you can write it now click save changes as a student i just submitted this finally 
if you are satisfied with the assignment you can click submit continue now this will be submitted for grading so totally i have written 25 words now i'll go to the faculty window so if you want to uh, grade the assignment just click assignment here there are totally five students were enrolled into this course and the submitted is one needs grading one so view all submissions so this person has submitted the uh, assignment submitted for grading just click grade so if they would have submitted any document here that will be visible but here this is the actual statement uh, um, written by the student so you can read this if you want to make some comments you can add here good work or if you want to give some uh, specific feedback you want to also write it here so out of 10 mark i'm giving seven marks for this and then you can also give some uh, overall feedback to the students so overall it's a good attempt keep it up something like that you can write whatever may be the thing you want to do you can type it here and then click save changes the changes to the grade and feedbacks were saved okay now you can exit this window because uh, successfully you have submitted this and submitted for grading it's already graded now you go to the course if you want to check the grades you can click the grades this is from the faculty window so this person as kanna has obtained seven marks so that will be visible here from the student window for example this is the student window page so i'm just going to the home page when they click this grades student can able to see the grade whatever may be the grade obtained by the person so here it's it says that assignment one seven out of ten so 75 70 percentage of the marks secured by the student overall it's a good attempt keep it up so this is a comment or feedback given by the faculty so this is the way how they can uh, uh, do the uh, uh, grading from the faculty side as well as how the student can uh, submit the assignment so now quickly i'll show you uh, from the faculty side uh, to upload the files also they can create the assignment they can allow the file types and then from the student side also either they can write the content suppose if the text box is allowed to write uh, by the faculty you can also do that otherwise uh, simply they can submit the uh, files either in pdf format or word format so this is the way how you can conduct the assessment thanks for watching this video